Hello YouTube. I wanted to do the um, TMI tag video. Uh, VSG Brit Brat and C. Jane Shrink both did it and tagged whoever was watching their video and wanted to do it. And I want to do it, so I'm going to. Um, I got a new tripod today. That's why I'm kind of like hovering here. I don't know how to use it yet. But I thought this would be a good way to one, test my new tripod and two, to kind of let everybody get to know me because I know I'm still kind of new here in the weight loss community. So here we go. I've got them printed out here. So I'm just going to read from them. What are you wearing? So I'm wearing this cute little top. I think it's cute from um, Torrid and um, Capri's and socks. That's it for now. Have you ever been in love? Yes. Have you ever had a terrible breakup? Yes. Um, how tall are you? I am five foot tall, exactly. How much do you weigh? 273 pounds. Any tattoos? No, I don't have any tattoos currently, but I do have um, two tattoos that I want. Any piercings? I have my ears double pierced, even though I don't wear um, either one of them because my hair is so long you can't ever really see earrings. And when I was 16, I had my belly button pierced. Um, that's kind of a funny story. Um, one of my friends, when I was 19, we were dancing in a club and his belt buckle got right underneath the ring and pulled it out. I still have a really bad scar on my belly button. OTP. So I feel like I'm the only one who knows what this is and I'm such a nerd, but I have a lot of OTPs, but right now my OTP is Robron. It is from a British soap opera called Emmerdale. It's Robert and Aaron. Uh, favorite show of all time, it's Friends. Uh, right now, it's not on yet, but Big Brother. And I like the MTV uh, challenges. Favorite bands? I have a lot of these. Um, if I go back to like high school, my favorite bands were like Taken Back Sunday, Fall Out Boy, stuff like that. Um, my favorite bands now are pretty much the same thing. If I go like this, can you still see me? Okay, cool. Pretty much the same thing. Uh, something that you miss. Carbs. Carbohydrates. I miss them a lot. Favorite song. My favorite song ever is One Headlight by The Wallflowers. How old are you? I'm 28 years old. Number 14, what's your zodiac sign? I'm a cancer. Number 15, a quality you look for in a partner. Um, Open-mindedness for one, kindness is a big deal to me. And just to be honest, I think intelligence is really, really very sexy. Favorite quote, I have a bunch of these, and the only one that comes to mind right now, being put on the spot, because I didn't do these beforehand, is really cheesy, but I agree with it. It's not about um, the breaths you take, it's about the moments that take your breath away. Favorite actor is Leonardo DiCaprio. My favorite color is pink. 19, loud music or soft? 98% of the time, I'm going to go with loud music. Number 20 is where do you go when you're sad? Right over here to my bed to sleep. Um, 21, how long does it take you to shower? That depends on if I wash my hair or not. If I don't wash my hair, like 12 minutes. If I do, like 25. Uh, number 22, how long does it take you to get ready in the morning? And that, again, depends on if I have to blow dry my hair or not. If I don't... About 45 minutes to an hour. If I do have to dry my hair, that's a whole nother process. So 23, ever been in a physical fight? Yes, when I was in high school. Uh, number 24 is turn-ons. I already said intelligence. That's a big one for me. Um, I just think kind of intelligence slash some people call nerdiness. It's very, very sexy. Uh, someone being open-minded is sexy. And of course, someone who can make me laugh turn off is someone who is like racist or 
you know, the inability to see life through someone else's eyes. I don't, I don't like that. The reason I joined YouTube is number 26. I joined YouTube because I love watching all the other vertical sleeve gastrectomy um, stories. I think they're really interesting. Um, it's really helped me a lot with a lot of questions that I had. And so if I can help someone, that will be great. And also I like to go back and watch these, you know, hopefully in a year from now, I'll have lost a lot of weight and I can go back and watch this. Um, 27 is fears. I actually have a lot of fears, but I'm going to go with one that I think is kind of funny so that this video isn't too serious. I have a fear of mayonnaise. Also jello, which I'm trying to get over because I'm going to need to eat it after my surgery. So I'm, I'm trying, but I'm, I'm still pretty afraid of jello. Number 28, the last thing that made you cry. Uh, today was the last time I cried and it was happy tears. Uh, my grandmother, who is my absolute best friend in the world, um, we found out earlier this year that she has breast and lung cancer, and we thought she was going to be going through six weeks of chemo and radiation, and we we're very blessed to know that they can still cure it, and we found out today that she, tomorrow will be her last treatment, and so we're pretty excited about that. Um... Number 29, last time you said you loved someone was five minutes ago before I came upstairs. Uh, number 30 is the meaning behind your YouTube name. Mine is Watch Kitty Shrink. It's My name is Jessica, but Kitty is my nickname. It has been since I was a baby. More people call me Kitty or some form of that than they do Jessica. So I hear Kitty, Kitten, and Jessie Cat far more than I hear my actual name. Um... I have had my Instagram account, my fitness Instagram account, for almost three years now. And the name on it is also Watch Kitty Shrink. So, and that was like a Weight Watchers account. But I've decided since to do the surgery. But I still wanted to keep the same name. Because eventually, I will get up the courage to tell everyone on my Instagram account about this channel. And about what I've decided to do. So, I just kind of wanted to keep it the same. Um, number 31 was the last book you read. Um, the last book I read was probably... Probably The Great Gatsby for the 100th time. No. For the 500th time, I'm obsessed with it. Um, some people have, like, comfort shows or comfort movies. I have a comfort book. Anytime I'm stressed, upset, whatever... I just turn on The Great Gatsby and I feel a lot better. Turn on. I pick up The Great Gatsby. The book you're currently reading. Um, I'm actually not currently reading anything, which is very strange for me. I'm getting ready after I finish this video to go find me something good to read. Um, oh, and less fan fiction counts because I am reading some of that. Uh, last show you watched was... Um, a new show on Showtime called Submission. Not sure how I'm going to like it. It was the first episode. Um, number 34 is the last person you talked to. And that was one of my best friends named Nellie. I'll be talking to her again in just a few minutes. Number 35. The relationship between you and the person you last texted. That was Nellie. She's been my best friend since I was like 12 years old. Um... Number 36 is favorite food. My favorite food ever is pizza, but I have not been eating that lately, so I'm going to go with shrimp. That's something that I love a lot now and that I can still eat even while watching my carbs. Um, 37, place you want to visit, Australia. 38, last place you were. I just got home yesterday from Pigeon Forge, Tennessee. Number 39, do you have a crush? Only on celebrities, not on anybody in real life. Uh, number 40, the last time you kissed someone was about five minutes ago. I kissed my mamma as I came up the stairs. We were all very happy about her news. Number 41, the last time you were insulted. I actually don't remember the last time I was insulted, which is probably a good thing because I get really emotional when I get insulted. 42, favorite fav flavor of sweet is anything sour. I like like the sour candy apple and stuff like that. Number 43, 
what instruments do you play? On occasion, after a few alcoholic beverages, I have been told that I'm very good at playing Ice Ice Baby on the guitar. Only the chorus, but I have been told I can do it. Number 44 is favorite piece of jewelry, and I'm going to come up and show that. This is my necklace. I don't know if you can see it, but it says forever in my heart from 1993 to 2015. And that says Mr. And that is a little cat. That is in memory of my cat who I had for 21 years who passed away in 2015. Number 45 is last sport you played. Is cornhole a sport? Because I played that last week. Uh, we're almost done here. This video is a little longer than I expected. 46, last song you sang. I sing all the time. What was it was in my head earlier? If I Die Young by the Bam Perry was randomly in my head. 47, favorite chat up line. I am way too shy and way too awkward to ever use a chat up line. Uh, number 48 is have you ever used it? No. Uh, 49, last time you hung out with someone. I hung out with my family this weekend while we was on like a mini vacation. Um, 50, who should answer these questions next? I'm going to um, say anybody who's watching this who wants to do it should do it. But I'm also going to call out my friend Claire, who has not made a video yet, but she is wanting to. I'm going to put her on the spot because I think the TMI tag is actually a really good first video to kind of introduce herself and get everybody used to her. All right, thanks.